Hey guys, Henry is right here. He's just chilling. Anyways, it is fall, which is wonderful. The weather's getting chillier. You're gonna start to layer some more. There's also pumpkin spice lattes, <laughs> which oh, you hate. Those are disgusting. There are some definite must have items though that you should get right now. That's just gonna set you up for fall and make sure you're looking fresh from head to toe. So today we're gonna talk about the top fall essentials you should own. The first one is pretty quintessential fall, and that is a flannel shirt. So with flannel shirts, you can wear them on their own or as a layering piece, which is what I love to do when I'm styling them on my clients. So you can layer them over a t-shirt. If it starts to get chillier, layer a jacket over it. And then you can also layer a coat over it, but it's a really good layering piece that is going to just allow you to inject some style. There's a sexiness about it because I don't know the flannel material. There's something about it because oftentimes when you see flannel shirts, they're um, usually in a plastic or some kind of pattern like that. And it feels really masculine. And so it's a really easy way to just inject pattern and color into your outfit as well as layering, which is always a great style move. And next up is near and dear to my literal heart right now because it's a bomber jacket. And guys, if you like this jacket, we'll link it in the description below so you can check it out and pick one up yourself. But a bomber jacket is universally going to look good on every single guy, regardless of his age, stature, or body type. Debate me on this in the comments if you think otherwise, but I'm telling you, it's this so absolutely works for everyone, yes. I really love them because they look sexy, they look like you're not trying too hard, but you look still really stylish and cool. I think it's just a great piece that every man should have in his closet. And you can go more fall oriented with your bombers by getting it like either quilted like this, or you can go with suede, you can go with wool, leather. I mean, you've got a bunch of options out there that are gonna look fantastic. Fantastic. The great thing about bombers is that you can play with colors, patterns, materials to just really add that special touch, your own personality into your outfits. And next up is something that we're gonna be wearing for the foreseeable future, but during the fall, especially towards the end of fall when it gets a little crisper out, these are helpful because they can keep your face warm. And that is a face mask. And guys, we saw some of the comments in one of the other face mask video that we did. Yes, they are absolutely a utilitarian item like shoes. So unless you're going to go back to the ice age and start wrapping your feet, you know, in <laughs> woolly mammoth wool and leathers from various hunts, uh, you probably want them to look good as well. And the beauty is, is that you can. They can also be functional and fashionable at the same time. There are so many great companies out there that are really adding like just a lot of great colors and textures patterns. and materials and patterns yeah, yeah. that we love. And so I'm definitely gonna list some of the ones that we really like below. So treat your face mask like an accessory and use it as an opportunity to just add some personality and some fun and some style into your outfits. Since the seasons are changing and the first thing anyone notices is your face, it is really important to have your fall and winter skincare routine on lockdown so that you can avoid dry, rough, patchy, chapped, chapped looking skin as the weather cools down. And since, as we mentioned before, you're gonna be wearing face masks more often, you really need to make sure your skincare is on lockdown because it can be very aggravating to your skin. This is why we're really glad to have Geology as today's sponsor. We really love them because of their simple and personalized skincare system that is specifically tailored to address your skin issues. So whether you have sensitive skin, dark under eye circles, wrinkles, acne, dryness. They have a quick, simple, straightforward solution to ensure your skin looks its best. So here's how it works. Go to this link or the link in the description and take a 30 second quiz about your skin and any specific issues you're having and they'll formulate a special regimen that will provide the benefits your skin needs the most. Then they quickly send you a 30 day trial set that includes two bottles of face wash, one for the sink and one for the shower, which I love a vital morning face cream, a repairing night cream, and a nourishing eye cream. So in order to make sure your skin looks its best this fall and winter, use the link on the screen, or like I said in the description below, plus this offer code for a very special bonus, and pick up your Geology skincare routine system today. Okay, so the next must have fall item you should get is a cross body bag or backpack. Or a bag in general. Yeah, a bag, <laughs> well look, 
here's the thing. Nowadays, you are not only carrying your phone, wallet, keys, you're also carrying hand sanitizer, um, some disposable gloves. Maybe you need a place also to put your mask as well when you're not using it. So you need something that's gonna carry those items because you can't stuff that all into your pants. <laughs> it's gonna you look have, bizarre. Can you it's delightful. <laughs> and for a list of favorites, check out the links in the description below. And next up is probably one of the more versatile items you can have in your wardrobe, uh, especially as it gets cooler. And that is a pair of, or multiple pairs of wool pants. I specifically love them because they're super easy to dress up or down. I mean, you could chuck on some sneakers with them or go all the way up to dress shoes, boots, etc., and they will look great no matter what. Now, as the weather cools down, you definitely want to get a thicker wool material, but the beauty is you don't really have to worry about this because the stores right now are going to carry a thicker wool that'll help keep you warm and insulated during these cooler months. Now, as far as colors go, you can go with dark brown, charcoal, black, burgundy, navy, dark green. I mean, these are all fantastic fall colors that are gonna work right now and into the colder months. And to go with those wool pants, you definitely should consider some sort of turtleneck or mock turtleneck. I don't know why, but I really like them. So much so that I might be wearing one. Well, you have a long neck, so turtlenecks are especially great for someone that has a long <laughs> neck. It does um, get a little cold, definitely. I'm a it, scarf turtleneck kind of yeah, guy. Yeah, it's a great layering piece though. So what you want to do though, because it's fall and it's not super cold and chilly, like you know, dead of winter is, yeah. you want to get more of a lightweight, either wool or cotton blend turtleneck or mock turtleneck, like what Storing's wearing, um, because that's going to allow you the ability to be able to layer jackets on top without you just overheating <laughs> once you get inside. Wearing a super thick wool turtleneck, like in like early October, depending on where you're you gonna, live, you're you could be, be sweating. sweating. <laughs> I find turtlenecks to be incredibly sexy on oh, a man. Oh, really? You don't say. And it's Did you a, know I'm wearing a turtleneck, Ashley? <laughs> it's a great way <laughs> to just show that you know what you're doing when it comes to just personal style. So it's a power style move, I think, is what Ash is trying to say. So pick them up this fall. Fall is my favorite season for two specific reasons. Number one, it's time to bust out the layers, which is so fun, and you get to be warm and look cool at the same time. And two, it's time to finally pull out those lace-up boots. A good pair of lace-up boots will go with your dark wash jeans, will go with your chinos, as well as your wool pants. You can go with dark brown, black, or you can go with a whole host of other colors, whatever you wanna add. But basically, I mean, in our minds, fall equals boots. So they are a definite must have in your closet. Some of our favorites in the description below. And the next item, I don't even know how it couldn't be on this list. It basically <laughs> will be on every essential list for every season because they are that important. And that is a pair of dark wash jeans, AKA indigo, dark blue, whatever you want to call them. A dark blue pair of jeans works across the board with basically anything and everything you would ever wear. Especially with the boots. Especially with <laughs> boots, obviously. But if you've already got those locked down and you want some additional colors, you wanna go with like a gray pair or a couple gray pairs and black, that'll cover you across the board. And then you could certainly add other colors as well. Like Asha said about other items, you got jewel tones, you know, you got burgundies, greens, browns, etc. Kind of have fun, but definitely start with a dark wash indigo pair. And the next must have fall essential item that you should definitely pick up is a trucker jacket. Now, you can get it in denim, but there's also suede, there's corduroy out there. That's definitely corduroy. kind of the new, I mean, the new trend this year, I think, is corduroy. We have a list of our favorites below, so definitely check it out. But as far as colors go, I mean, you can go with camel, you can go with dark green, a gray color. You have so many options, and because it's fall and it's gonna be getting chillier, you need a couple, I feel like a couple good fall jackets just to kind of help you be able to layer and change up your outfits and insert the style of personality that you want to insert into your looks. And a quick tip, if you want a nice fitted look, which I prefer, they tend to run a little boxy, go down a size or two, and you don't have to be able to button them up. They're not gonna be like the game changer of like, oh, thank God I can button my jacket up, now I'm super warm. They're not really supposed to be worn like that, so what you do is you go down a size or two and it will make it a nice trimmer fit for the body. That is my preference and my hack for you. But. I'm gonna be the devil's advocate sure. and Devil say- Advocate as well. Yes, I am gonna say, you should probably get your own size if you intend to wear like hoodies underneath it or just wanna layer even more underneath. You need a little bit of room so that just it's not, you're, it's not like skin tight. I don't like wanna- a, Like a sausage. <laughs> I don't wanna be able to move my arms. That's how <laughs> fitted I like my denim jackets. I like I being know. able to just 
like a Tyrannosaurus Rex. Obviously, because we live in LA, you're not gonna layer that much, so of course you want it more trim. But okay, if, you, all right. if your fall is chillier, you want to have some room in the jacket to be able to layer underneath. I guess you work with clients <laughs> that don't all live in LA, so maybe no. you had to think about that. <laughs> Anyways, all right, she's got a point. So if you live in a colder environment and you're gonna layer pretty heavy with it, maybe go with your normal size. But if you're like me and you like that fitted look and you don't care about mobility, go down a size. All right, guys, thanks so much for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.